गुड मॉर्निंग फ्रेंड्स आई एम सूरज अग्रवाल एंड यू आर वाचिंग योर फेवरेट यूट्यूब चैनल गार्डनिंग इज माय पैसन टुडे फ्रेंड्स आई विल बी टेलिंग योर एक्सेलेंट प्लान दिस इज द मदर ऑफ थाउजेंड्स एंड दे आर ब्लूमिंग एंड दिस इज द विंटर सीजन इन अर्ली विंटर सीजन यू कैन सी लॉर्ड्स ऑफ लोर्ड्स ब्लूम एंड इन द मंथ ऑफ नवंबर डिसम्बर जनवरी दे ब्लूम नाइसली एंड समटाइम्स द फ्लावर्स ओपन अप एंड समटाइम्स द फ्लावर डोंट ओपन अप एंड द प्लान इज ऑल्सो कॉल्ड मैक्सिकन हेड प्लान एंड यू सी दिस इज द एयर ब्लेल type that's why this uh, plants is also named as air bell plant and lots of lots of around more than 200 varieties of uh, mexican head plant you can see and uh, they bloom and is they bloom uh, once in a year and the plants leaf look like mexican hat and that's why i have kept some mexican hat and that's why the plant is also known as mexican hat plant and this is the herbal plant i tell you lots of medicine are prepared from these plants and uh, i tell you how to grow them just uh, collect some of the leaves from here and you can grow the leaves and from the edges of the leaves new seedlings will come out from here from the new saplings will come out from here hundreds of saplings will come out from here just see from uh, one part of my leaf i am tearing out and uh, taking these leaves and uh, breaking the leaves here just see lots of lots of uh, saplings you can see just grown from the leaves sides of the leaves you see and uh, now i am uh, tearing out this is the plants leaves i am collecting from the leaves this is the plant saplings and they pro reproduce uh, vegetatively from the edges of the leaves and the leaves you can grow again and from the edges new plants will come out and this is the uh, calancho diagram montiana or earlier the name is a uh, bryophyllum diagram montiana and now i will grow uh, this uh, plants here i earlier i collected two plants only from my garden now this has turned totally a jungle total a jungle uh, hundreds of plants i have to throw away hundreds of plants from here and now if you are collect your plant any soil any kind of soil you can grow clay soil sandy soil loamy soil any kind of soil you can grow and you don't need much of the fertilizer in any pot you just uh, push the plant here just uh, put the plants here and they will grow now i tell you if you want to grow in any kinds of soil i will tell you the best soil mixture for growing it or else uh, if you have any kind of soil sandy soil loam soil or clay soil you can grow without fertilizer also they will survive very nicely now i tell you the easiest uh, soil mixture for this uh, mother of thousands here you can take around any kind of soil that should be 70% of garden soil 20% compost maybe vermi compost or cow dung compost and 10% river sand that is construction sand mix it well this is the easiest if you don't have river sand construction sand or compost that will also do no nothing to worry and just fill up the uh, pot here and uh, grow just push down the saplings here and they will grow and after two days one or two days gap you water them because they are succulents so we will not be watering today so here you can see this is the plant sapling i am pushing down in soil mixture and just let it be there keep it in semi shade for 2 to 3 days then you can keep in full sunlight here lots of lots of plants are here just wherever you see the leaves are touching the ground and hundreds of plants grow in the summer time you will grow they propagate through vegetative through leaves uh, they grow and here i am telling you another method of propagation this is also a very nice method just fill up your pot here with the soil mixture here and you can grow with the leaves only just uh, take uh, collect any leaf from any of the garden or any of the friend's house just uh, cut a leaves from here a leaf here just see how i am collecting the leaf and after collection of leaves just uh, bury it under soil mix and this is the method and then you can water it in once in 3 to 4 days and you can keep it any place and in a uh, couple of days you will see they will grow from uh, edges of this uh, uh, leaves new saplings will grow out so this is the method and the another third method i am showing you just take cuttings how to take cuttings with the help of a blade or a pair of scissor and remove the lower side leaves here and uh, after removal of lower side leaves just push down the stems 
and uh, the leaves you have collected you can push down the leaves also and new saplings will grow out from there also and these uh, cutting i have uh, pushing down in soil and just keep it in shade for 3 to 4 days and they will and uh, i think i tell you that uh, these are mostly used is in uh, leukemia or blood cancer and in the removal of stones in kidneys in uh, ayurveda or in herbal medicine they are used and uh, i tell you they cannot be propagated from seeds they do not produce seeds that's why they are propagated through vegetative propagation through leaves hope you enjoyed the video and uh, thank you for watching the video please visit my channel again and again for nice videos